welcome to a new game. This is in most. Um, it's a, an indie game that I got included in a charity bundle many, many years ago. Um, I'm under the impression it's sort of a creepy kind of game. Um, I could be wrong. I'm not entirely sure. So let's jump into it. can't reach it, I need to put something on top of the table. Okay. So light kills me.
zero out of eighty five. I'm hiding here. I'm very good at hiding. No one has been able to find me for years. Or maybe everyone has just gone home. No, I'm sad. I help my brother hide behind the houses. Don't look for him, please. It was hard, but someone had to do it. He disappeared. Drop my key down the well. That is going to punish me. Why did you do it? Why did you push me? Why is this happening to me? I didn't push you. Oh shit. Goodness.
developers nailed it. I'm so confused about what's you going on. Remember? What? Do you remember it? That tale about flowers? Wait, I'm an old man. I thought it was a good story. I thought it's sure to have a happy ending. I was wrong. It's a tale about pain. Let me tell you. Again. These lands were dead, destroyed, and devastated. All you could hear was the whisper of the ashes. Then, a stranger came. He held a spark in his hand. The stranger opened his hand, and the spark was set free. Light returned. Yet pain was the price for this light. Screaming filled the air. Time passed. The screaming grew silent. Pain became a familiar friend. Some disappeared from the lands. No one knew whether they had crept away or been taken by pain. Yet many also remained. Castles which once rose into the skies fell into ruins. Time wiped clean any trace. Centuries passed. The people started calling the stranger the Keeper of the Spark. He kept watch over the land, soaking up the pain of its people. I really but like her the voice. the people had hope. They were growing flowers. Really like her voice. Okay, I see, I see. Where am I? 
this. Please focus. Oh my god. I'm not focused.
find. This is the handle? It better be. I just don't notice these things like fast enough. I suck at video games. I will. You opened the grate. Okay, well, go. I'm not sure it won out anymore. Okay. Oh, there I am. Oh my god! Cold was the light of the spark. Terrible at price.
Dios mío. Others serve the Keeper out of greed, expecting to be rewarded for their service. into the lands and they gathered the pain. Oh goodness, the pain multiplied. And their own hearts blackened. Am I a bad guy when I play this guy? that I'm trying to Yeah, we need the, the fucking knife. knife. <sighs> Alright guys, I'm not supposed to be here.
above buddy, come on. What the hell? I don't know if this is just like for achievements or, or what. sitting in this tree for days now. Don't even ask what was in the bucket. Gross. Hey, don't touch the pillow. Okay. Oh, oh, hello. I'm stuck. I'm an explorer. I was exploring the tower when the bridge got stuck. The generator is out of fuel, so the bridge was, so the bridge has stayed up. Good thing I have a bed and a pillow in this tree. And a teapot. Never leave home without a teapot, do you hear? Or without a telescope, of course. I've been following this rule since I was 11. Oh yeah, I am stuck. You need to start a generator to lower the bridge. Will you help me? If I'm not mistaken, the fuel is in the cave near the tree. This tree, as you can probably see, has a handy set of cranes. They'll help you haul the fuel up. Basically, all you need to do is find a can, pull it under the crane, drop the hook, attach the can, pull up the can, take it off the hook, drop another hook, pull the can over to the hook, attach the can, climb up, raise the hook, take the can off the hook, pull it beneath the final hook, attach it to the hook, climb up, raise the hook, take the can off the hook, pull the can over. <gasps> and pour the fuel into the <gasps> into the generator easy as pie you see plain and simple okay right take take this you're going to need it to open the cave okay Okay, we need the thing for that.
that sparkling? Those stones. You know what those are? Oh, yes, it's pain. Sweet pain. Let me see it. Every living thing feels pain. Every blade of grass, every little bug. Finding it is hard, though. Few can do it. Oh, the castle is expanding. It consumes these lands. It brings the pain with it. Are you a snake? A huge creature Creature lived here. She knew nothing of joy, nothing of grief, no emotions. It was a good time for her. She hunted and she fed her offspring, hundreds of them. But her spark is growing dim. Her world will never be the same. Touched by the castle, her offspring are changing. The castle has brought fear. She is locked with them. She fears them. They are poisoning her. One day she will die, and perhaps this will be a blessed day for all of us. That castle and that tower behind me, they haven't always been there. Once the spark shone brightly and the world was full of light and of life, there was a shadow too with small creatures living in it. Pain lived in them as it lived in everyone else, yet they were almost oblivious to it. They were happy. One day, something changed. It wasn't their fault. Everything changes. They were no longer content with being small and weak. They decided that for them to become strong, someone else must become weak. They chose their victim. They nurtured their pain, collected it, mixed it in with hatred, then poured it all over their victim. And as their victim became weaker from the burden, they thought they were becoming stronger. It wasn't their fault. But the land around them changed, as it changed around him. No one saw it happen. Soft earth turned to stone. Green grass turned to black ash. And stone upon stone, the walls started rising. Oh, no one could bear to see it. Everybody turned away, nurturing their pain and hatred so they could pour it out again. Oh, bringing more fresh pain. Oh, a tiny bit more. Find just a tiny bit more. Oh, okay. Oh! Okay, I see. It's like spending it. Okay. Oh my goodness.
days ago. I've even tried using those leaves, but I'm not sure what tastes better, them or the straw from my mattress. Great! That's just gr Oh. The other half is still raised. Can you do anything about it? Can I not, like, jump? Is that for the pickaxe? No. Right, um... with mattress straw one more time today, I might not have been responsible for my actions. Right, what you gonna do now, buddy? of any real place, but... Oh, oh, oh. What the... Huh? Okay. What do I do with those? Uh-oh. Where's my elevator? I definitely had an elevator here. The rope is cut. Hmm. It's probably stuck somewhere below. Would you go and check it for me? Sure. And then I just go. I checked it. I knew it. This slime, it's everywhere. The castle, it's expanding and bringing slime with it. My poor little rope. I need some materials to fix it. Mm, I saw some itty bitty. Oh. No. I can't. Oh my god. In the cave under the house. That means there's spider web. Oh, oof. You'd be surprised how many things get caught in the web bugs, flies, mosquitoes, squirrels, owls, all kinds of stuff, really. So I thought, what if some spider silk got caught in the web? I could fix the elevator with it. Here it is, the key to the mines. Oh my god. But be careful. Once I saw a whole pack of wolves down there in the web. And wolves are very dangerous. Dude, oh my god. 
I'm okay with wolves. I'm just not okay with spiders. God dang it. I hate spiders. I can't. I can't do this. There's a strange smell. And it's not me. Squirrels. Where am I? Or a raccoon. What does a raccoon smell of? Like this, I guess. An, an acorn on a stick. Someone tried to become friends with a squirrel or a raccoon. table with no teapot and no one to drink tea with. Oh, a teapot. There's rainwater in it and some straw. How did it get there? I'll keep it. It'll make for some nice tea. The swing is broken. Would you like some tea? Plants are drying up. It must have been beautiful here once. <gasps> oh shit. This flower withered long ago. There's water everywhere. I don't know any numbers. The store is always locked. Cornflakes, eggs, bourbon. record player surprisingly it still works it's dark the switch must be somewhere around here I can't reach it there's something behind the crate It sure is heavy. Um, maybe I'm supposed to ask for help. A big box, I can stand on top of it. 
with you. Good kid. Well, that's one way to bring it down. sitting here all alone. What is that? It's a bunny? Is it a bunny doll? Are you shitting me? Guy. What?
I didn't get the silk though. Fucking hell. Like this has to be a bad guy. No right? one knew where the people kept disappearing to. Hearted grew their flowers, for the secret of the flowers lives on. I don't know what to do. Oh. 
service of the Keeper could not grow their own power. Knight could never grow his own flower. He stole someone else's. What a bitch. But the stolen flower would never accept him. Good for the it's flower. Wrong. The knight will be forever damned for this. For all eternity. Like this person has a really soft voice. I mean this in a in a positive way by the way. So <gasps> What is that? Squirrel or the raccoon? Hello. Break. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Break, break, break. <gasps> Yo.
the goal.
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. the bunny, isn't it? maybe serious? I can't push it anymore. I can't push it anymore. What the hell, man? So... hear the clock ticking even through a wall. anyone play it. Okay. I see it. Table. Some figures are replaced by buttons.
my goodness. I'm sorry, it's taking too long for me to figure shit out. I'm sorry. <gasps> sorry for yawning, too. Hey, bunny. There you are, little one. Now I'm going to hide. From what? From the bunny? What? I couldn't close my eyes in time. What? I try. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I try, but I buttons for eyes. Let's have another go. So, okay, it's her imagination, I think. Ready or not, here I come. But how do I get the ladder down? Okay, I gotta go get the umbrella. That's that is downstairs. scary in here. How'd you get in here? You brought me here yourself, don't you remember? I can't walk, you know. My legs are all bloody and broken. Bones are sticking out all over. My life is only pain and agony. I am joking. I am a toy. Toys don't walk around. You're strange. What do you think is behind this door? I heard strange noises in the attic last night. I heard screams. They're being kept there. Who are? The abducted kids? Oh gosh, we need to free them. How heartless one should be to keep small kids in the attic. They keep you in an empty room with thorn wallpaper. That's quite a step up, you should be proud. That's his fault, he's evil. I heard her crying again tonight. He treats her badly. He makes her do horrible things. That's why she cries constantly. His heart is black. We will save the kids and she'll know then that she can also escape. But the door is locked. We need a key. The keys are often hidden in the candy bowls. So you can take some candy when you find the key. Or even if you don't. Especially if you don't. She is baking cookies. I like cookies more than candy. Old weathered crates. Claw marks. Something was trying to break out. Shouldn't the marks be inside the crate then? So something was trying to break in. Newspaper clippings about a fire. Something is floating in the... That's 
severed fingers. That's pickles. Green bumpy fingers. Alright, I see it, I see it, I see it. The cookies are on the top shelf. How devious and cruel of her. Get the chair from the hall. From the hall? What hall? to get the silk though. I just don't know how now. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Once a witch lived here. She was different then. No one had called her a witch yet. She loved this 
world and every fragment of life within it. Her eyes glowed with a desire to live. She wanted to make the world better. She studied it. She knew about the castle. She wanted to stop the castle. But she couldn't do it alone. And the one who was with her, it didn't help her. He was never around. She seemed strong, yet she was weak. She grew her own soul flower. She thought the flower would destroy the castle. Yet the castle kept growing. She couldn't stop it. And one day, the castle consumed her flower. Oh, she lost the most precious thing she had. It changed her forever. She cursed this world and all that lived on it. She would never be the same again. Despite the efforts of the one who was with her, yet never around. Oh, bring me more fresh pain. 30. Ah, human. You're not the first stranger in this world. The knight, I know you can see him. You can see what he did. He wasn't born here, just like you. These are not his lands. This is not his castle. But the castle has consumed the soul, as it has many others. One day will consume yours too, but the knight did not cease his fight. Though his heart was black, and he was now a servant to the keeper of the spark. His desire remained unchanged, and the fire showed him the way. Oh, human, the storm is coming. Oh, bring me more fresh pain. Forty. I have thirty-seven. I don't even know, man. Oh, it's a family. Seriously, what the fuck do I do with that thing? Or to that thing? Wait, 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 wait. <sighs> I'm a dumbass. Um, I do have to to get inside the the carcass of the of the creature. Oh my god! God damn, like. Like, I don't think the game is hard, I'm just an idiot. And that is on me. Good lord. No, no. Wait, what? Yeah, here's what we were supposed to do. 
supposed to do? Black heart. <laughs> yes, he becomes black when touched by pain. Yours isn't as black yet, but soon. The pain saps your strength, yet it can give you more. It's up to you to decide what to do with it. Is it really so bad for it to be black? You can't stop caring about others. This opens many doors, you know. You will know soon anyway. The witch will take the most precious thing you have. <laughs> you can't take my heart, by the way. I don't really need it. Now go. Get back to that idiot. Let him fix a stupid elevator. Remember how easily your life broke and the lives of those who are dear to you. One a little step and whoosh, three lives are no more. <laughs> Forever or what? All right, good lord. silk what we don't have a silk You're back, and you got me the web. How did you deal with the wolves? Anyway, all that can wait. I didn't get a web, though. What? Guy. What the heck are you doing? Ready? Great. Off we go.
sorry, buddy. Did we crash into the castle? And then you get into the car and drive to work. But I can't drive. And I can't work. I'll teach you. You just need to pull the rope or push the car. And what about work? Duh, you just leave the house and come back later tired and angry. Well, no wonder you come back angry if you have to push the, your car to work each day. I don't think I will ever try to work, if that's all the same to you. Just don't push too hard. I don't want to drive close to her. She's got a knife. You are so stupid. She must not hear us. died it was really scary why is she angry all the time they argue constantly i can hear them through the wall he buys me presents but i never touch them did he bring you the car as well no i found it in a garden it was under a pile of dry leaves i'm not sure who it belonged to it's scary can we do something less stressful changed it is less less of a prison but you can't buy me over would you like more tea mr rabbit oh yes if you would be so kind it's spilling i think your tea is decidedly exceptional today what is your secret, Mrs. Elizabeth? Why, there's no secret. I have just added a tiny drop of love to it. And also a caterpillar crawled into a teapot yesterday. I think it's still inside. This is simply exquisite. I have heard a thing about noble families. There are no spoons. Noble families don't have spoons. We don't. How are we going to eat the cake without spoons? Well, we can just use hands. Hands! I beg your pardon, miss. We are not some unwashed rabble. I don't know about you, but... Did you hear that? Something fell over in the attic. If you fall from here, you can break your leg or your neck, and you won't be able to walk then. You know, I'm not able to walk too. You'll just be, you'll be just like me then. Wouldn't it be nice?
Just a pile of rags. It's moving. No. We're on a planet hurling through the universe with inconceivable speed in a wild dance of the galaxies. So technically, I'm right. It's moving. bitch Good lord Oh, I was so scared. Same. Someone's really locked there. I thought you were kidding about the kids. I I don't think I saw any children here other than you. I don't remember, but someone is there. No, there must have been the wind. The window opened and something fell over. But safe bet it is so. I once saw the wind blow over a whole house. It was made of cards, but it's a fact nonetheless. I, I don't think... Cake! Our imaginary cake is going to go stale if we don't eat it right this very moment. Have you any idea how hard it is to bake an imaginary cake? Any idea how much effort I put into it? First you need to come up with imaginary flour, then imaginary eggs. Now where would you even get imaginary eggs unless you have an imaginary chicken? And the chicken, where does it come from? From the egg. But how would you get imaginary eggs if you don't have an imaginary chickens yet? He nearly blew my mind. But here it is. The cake. In all its imaginary awesomeness. We still have no spoons for the cake. I'll get them from the kitchen. She is making dinner. The spoons must be on the table. Oh, we are so in trouble. Stop this! Stop this! Stop this! Why can't you just disappear? Why are you still here? Get lost! Get lost, you monster! I'm so very confused about what is going on. I just hope the kid is alright. First and foremost.
You have so many fucking tools. So, fucking thought so.
because it's raining.
What? That that is some bullshit. my dog please please tell me that is it oh my god thank you As long as the spark shines over these lands, pain is locked inside every soul. What? Um. escape these lands. To a 
place where the Keeper has no dominion over them. Even those whose souls turned black, who gave in to their desires. Yes. Even they believe. But belief in what, though? I'm very confused. Very confused. But the Keeper won't ever let them go. Harvest and nurture and steal. And even more so, the pain they suffer themselves.
shit. Okay, I think I have all the, the tools then. she'd return and so she will the knight could never grow his way out of these lands his heart was black but he stole where you belong to him he stole another soul flower he built his way out of fire and pain that wasn't his and the witch saw what he had done and she hated him for it but only the witch could bind the soul flower to the knight's dark hearts only the witch who could break down the barrier to the flower and so visit her. He pleaded with her. He argued with her. He threatened her. He begged her. But the witch hated the flower that had sprung from the fire. And the witch hated the knight. Hated him because once she had her own flower and lost it. Because the knight had forgotten her pain. Because the knight stole another flower to keep for himself. She could have bound her heart to the flower that sprung from the fire. Be better to do it, but she never would, for she had her own flower and lost it, and there was no hope left for her, just the pain. Each time she saw the flower, she moved another step deeper into madness. Do you feel it? The storm is coming. The witch will burn this world to ashes, and then you shall meet her. Once again. Oh, bring me more fresh pain. Or, ooh, that's 50. I don't think I can, man. Hey, I don't know where to go. Like, there were locked doors, right? At the top somewhere. Oh, goodness. Maybe there is where I'm supposed to go. Oh, God. Like, I can't think of anything else. I can't talk to him no more. I need to go through the other side. Yeah, that is exactly what I need. Okay. Alright. Alright. I'm on track. I'm on track. I figured it out. I'm on track.
think I'll have to drop it, unfortunately. was I hope I'm doing this correctly, man. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Wait, break? Let's do it. traveling well you know we used to have a home but someone decided we got to go traveling and dropped us here so now we're traveling Interesting. Yo, I found you. And now there's color, too.
We're going to share the flower. That's sweet. You're disappearing, why? I need a key. I have to know what's in there. There's a telescope on top of the cabinet. I like watching stars. I like watching the neighbor's windows. Good lord. The crates are covered with cloth. The cracks adorn with images of teddy bears. I hate those creatures. Toy bears are toy rabbits' natural enemies. Once we will wipe them all from the face of the earth in a mighty blaze of inescapable vindication. Oh, and their ashes will cover the roofs of our doll houses. Push the d what? Wait, what? Wait. Far with her long ago. Oh. Where would the water be? Uh, the key be. I think there's an air vent near the ceiling. I can use it to get into their room. What? How did. It doesn't matter.
I'm not afraid anymore. She left. She should be afraid now. Frame the awards all covered with dust. Everyone forgot about them long ago. He used to treasure them. Now he doesn't care at all. How would you know that? I... I don't remember. There's a passage above the door. You can use the books to climb up. Pictures are all covered and the windows haven't been open in a long while. The floor is dirty. She used to like everything clean. She... Something happened. How do you know all that? I... Maybe I used to be your toy? Don't forget about him too. He's always at his work. This is, this was, I think this was a raccoon. How could it be? There's nothing here, just some old junk. Nice Ito with the shadow there. Where are the abducted kids? Where are they hiding them? The chimney. What? The chimney from the fireplace. But there's no fireplace.
need to make a new recording. Oh, sorry about this. The cellar is full of children's old things. I was right. They are abducting kids. Get me out of here. Get me out of here, please. Mommy, Daddy, please, where are you? They were the ones abducting kids. No one can leave while the keeper still needs them. Oh. Oh, come on, game. I was not ready. still grow their flowers, for the secret of the flowers lives on. Those who live in the light of their flower are free from pain and hidden from the keeper's ever vigilant gaze. have their own soul flower. There is no escape for them, for black are their souls. Turn into one Even of them. if you steal a flower, it'll never be yours. Such things should never happen. must stay with those who gave them life.
I'm so confused. Oh, it's a cutscene. I just need to grab supplies. Water. Need to grab some water.
there's blood everywhere. going to leave the three of us just like we wanted. He's with her already, soon I'll be there too. He never away. wants a night, you know. One way or another, we all serve the Keeper. And we all have our desires. Most importantly, his heart was not all black. He had grown his own soul flower. because of her money. What a bunch of losers. I don't care if they're like five-year-olds. They're losers. He did not manage to save it, though. And that was his undoing. Save what? The, the soul flower? Well, she never forgave him. But yes, he did steal that second flower. something you do not know. You were too young then, and no one told you. 
Everyone was so busy, so preoccupied with their own pain. He stole the flower from death. Stole you away. And accepted you with all his heart. She couldn't, though. She blamed him. She blamed you. What? Some have to face more pain than they can handle. And the pain broke her. She wanted them to leave together. To follow their flower. And that night, they did leave. She took him with her. She took my son. What? So you're like grandpa. Well, adoptive grandpa. This is fucking dark, man. The pain stays with us forever. It can subside. It may grow dull, but it'll never leave us. 
and we live with it, doing our best not to let it dissolve us. We fight it every day. But there are different kinds of pain. They're sacrificing yourself. The father, consumed by work, trying to give his child a better future. The mother, dedicating herself to her family until there is nothing left of her. Your pain is the price you pay to make someone else feel better. To make someone else smile, if only for a moment. But trading someone else's happiness for your pain is not the only way. Life doesn't want your pain. It doesn't need your suffering. It simply is what it is. You don't have to fight it. All we can do is remember those who are gone and do our best for those who remain. All of us carry our pain within us. Another way, even if you're in pain, another way is to take someone else's pain and make it your own. Do you remember? Do you remember it? That tale about pain? I was wrong. It's a tale about love. I will tell you, tell you once again. guys that was in most um i really 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 enjoyed it um the sound like everything in terms of audio is probably my favorite thing about the game um i really enjoyed the the visual like the art style even the color scheme um the game isn't for the big majority of it it's not colorful right it's pretty much the same shades the same tones um but it never felt boring i never felt tired of of looking at it uh even if it is like a, a sh you know like a game you can you can finish in in one sitting although i did need to check a, a guide here and there to to proceed um but that's because i suck at the game uh i suck at most games Anyways, uh, it's not, excuse me, it's not the, the game's fault or the developer's fault uh, in any way. The story was incredibly confusing for me. So, so, so confusing. But I still kept playing and I still kept enjoying like the puzzle elements of, of the game. I, ju I just did not like the, the massive, ugh, goodness, goodness gracious. The massive spider, but, you know, that's just um, a really personal thing for me. Um, but other, other, other than my arachnophobia, this was incredibly, incredibly enjoyable. Um, even if the themes are very dark, even if the story is quite, quite, quite heavy, um, I was entertained to, to play through... Uh, Sorry, the puzzle elements, the combat, the trying to figure out what is going on, and at the very end, like the ending sequence, it was very clear, and I really appreciate that, uh, particularly in a game that, for me, was being like incredibly cryptic up to that point. Uh, maybe because English is not my native language. Maybe because. Um, it's 1 a.m. Uh, maybe because I'm an idiot and I just struggle to understand things. Um, 
Yeah, I really, really, really enjoyed it. Um, in terms of replayability value, I am under the impression that there are things that I didn't discover, uh, actions that I, that I could have taken that I didn't. Uh, I don't really want to spoil, um, but you can definitely... Um, I think this game, because of those reasons, is one of the games that has replayability value. And considering that the game is so, is so short, I think it can... I think it's a good a good candidate, you know, if you're just looking for a game that you can easily 100% because the game is just so short, so you can just uh, replay it uh, quickly. Especially once you already know where everything is and like what's the sequence of, of doing things, basically. Because you kind of go back and forth, um, you know, on the map. Uh, almost like a Metroidvania, which... I really don't like, I really hate when I'm backtracking and I'm aware that I'm backtracking. But this game is so short, the map is so short, that and shortcuts kept being unlocked that I was like, okay, yeah. Okay. It, it's not it's not bad yet. It's not bad yet. I can cope with this still. Okay, cool. Um yeah. I I really enjoyed this game. I really, really, really did. Um, well, guys, that's it for me. Thank you so much for watching. I leave um, a link for the itch.io page, which is where I got this game uh, originally. Um, so, yeah, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you soon.